she was a punk rocker from East Cambridge with a voice like Jodie Foster. I had met her in my advanced nude photography class. It wasn't until we'd graduated that we found ourselves alone in a, an 80s hot tub, all to ourselves after all the loser older townies had left. And she asked if she could kiss me. Oh God. And she leapt across the water at me, took my face in her hands, and for the first time I felt a woman kissing me. And George Winston was playing and I could smell chemicals and cedar or whatever hot tubs are made of. And she was climbing all over me and she told me how beautiful I was. And later in the shower, she looked at me like the end of the world as I closed my eyes and imagined how I would not run away from this promised life. Love of women and all the fucking things that go with it. I would stay with the dyke in me, embrace the fucking Amazon. I would open my chest to the world that would spit on me. And I would run away with this girl that I fell in love with the instant I saw her blue eyes. But I didn't. I turned away. I never inserted a finger in another woman. I would say, I don't do that with women. Below the belt? The taste. No. So I went through my 20s with semen shot down my throat. And I swallowed it. Every time. And I wondered what I missed that moment when she plunged her finger in me. My best friend. And I said, no. And I started to cry. And I grabbed my clothes and ran from the room. <sighs>